who they uh, have uh, equation he says from physics the ice and steam point of a certain thermometer are minus 20 degrees minus 20 degrees and 100 degrees respectively they calculate the Celsius temperature corresponding to 70 degrees on the thermometer and we have how I will introduce you in solving this which is known interpolation so below is the ice point and above is the steam point so the ice point is minus 20 degrees respectively and the steam point is sorry the ice point the ice point of a thermometer is zero degrees sorry zero degrees zero degrees and the steam point is 100 degrees celsius zero degrees celsius so now say so the ice point is minus 20 degrees the, the ice point is minus 20 degrees and the steam point 100 is 100 degrees to calculate the celsius temperature so the celsius temperature is x we don't know it because x corresponding to 70 degrees corresponding to 70 degrees so in this case make it like this we'll say interpolation x minus 100 100 minus x x minus 100 divided by 100 minus x is equals to 70 minus minus 20 divided by 100 minus minus 20 so we'll start by saying x x minus 100 minus sorry minus 0 degrees celsius minus 0 degrees celsius divided by 100 100 minus 0 degrees celsius is equal to 70 70 minus minus 20 divided by 100 minus minus 20 so x minus 0 is x over 100 is equal to 70 minus multiply minus is plus 20 divided by 100 plus 20 so you will see x divided by 100 is equal to 90 divided by 120 70 plus 20 100 plus 20 so yeah next thing is to cross multiply cross multiply so x times 120 is equals to 90 times 100 so the next step is divide both sides by 120 divide both sides by 120 x, x yeah so therefore x is equals to 90 times 100 divided by 120 so x is 0 I mean it's 0 2 here is 5 2 here is 6 so it will be 90 multiply 5 divided by 6 90 multiply 5 divided by 6 so we can still break down 3 here is 2 3 here is 30 2 here is 1 2 here is 15 so we left with 15 and 5 so it will be 15 times 5 which was 2 5 times 5 is 25 5 into 75 degrees so that is our answer thank you